And hello everybody, welcome back to a new episode of Civilization 6. We are playing the uh, the Germans, and we're going to continue our conquest of America. Now they've got a lot of units over here, which is quite impressive actually. Uh, the question is, do we want to take out the units first, or do we want to take the city first? Well, once we take the city, it doesn't really matter about the units, because then we can either peace out, or we can just continue attacking them via the coast. So that should be fine. Um... We are going to bring up our destroyers anyways in preparation for our assault via the ocean. And yes, we are continuing as we are. So, in this case we will utilize our aircraft powers. Take out that tank. Um, yes, yes, you're fine. We'll skip the turn. Thank you. And we might as well also just do these. Ooh! Ooh, ooh. Ooh, bad. Very bad, actually. That's what I'm thinking. I'm gonna do this, that, this, and then... That. Boom! Cool. Alright, and then... You've already used your turn. We've got this tank to... Yep, do that. And we should be able to start to... I know, this city's been bothering us for a long time. A long time. But that's okay. Let it continue bothering us. I ain't bothered. Now this tank needs to heal. But we do need to get our forces through. And that's what we're going to do. Ah, jeez. can take quite a beating, that one. Um, and yeah, I really don't want you to be too vulnerable there, so actually head back in that direction. And then heal. Okay, cool! So, now we need to build a lighthouse, actually, would be decent. And Washington. Washington, D.C. It's really cool. I like the true start thing. Oh! Yeah, I think he just took out my pikeman. <laughs> uh, well, he wasn't getting any upgrades anytime soon. I think he was the army one, too, which is just... Oh. Damn you! Curse you! What is this? Did we get another rebellion? Oh! Oh, oh! Oh! Now that is a nasty, nasty rebellion. Okay. We can purchase something, though, I think. Ugh, no, we can't. Hmm. What do you upgrade to? Anti-tank crew is not bad. <sighs> Darn it. This is seriously not good. Well then, I guess we'll just continue as we are anyways. I just keep trying to take this city out. Oh, damn! Alright, you can take him down, which is fantastic. And we will move the Wehrmacht into, into the region in which we will conquer the world. That wasn't quite what I'd hoped you'd do, but okay, yep. Could always use that worker. Annoying. Oh, don't make sounds like that. That's horrible. Why would you do that? And you could actually deploy here. Maybe they're in range. And if they are, well... Well, bully for you! We're not quite there yet, are we? No. Yeah, we're always lacking just a little bit more firepower. You can attack. You can also attack. You can actually also attack, yeah. And maybe I'll send you this way. Oh, no, that's a terrible idea. I don't even know why you were there. We're about to get totalitarianism, which will help with our unhappiness issues and, of course, military. This sucks. This is actually really bad. 
And I almost wonder if maybe we should just, like... <sighs> like, what have they got? Have they got... <sighs> tanks. Okay. I mean, anti-tank crew's not bad. Alright, build the bank. They'll pillage the crap out of everything, which is fine. What we need to do now is take out Delhi and Cairo and... Ah! Oh, sabotaged! Again. AI's getting better at this game, so that's good. Alright, good. They're spreading out a bit. Unfortunately, they're pillaging districts, which is not quite what i like to see. Let's see if you guys can't take that down. Why can't this city attack? Why, why can't you attack? That doesn't make sense. Do we still have that infantry around here? We do! Cool. Alright, now we should be able to take it. Ah, oh, yes! Stop rushing me. Boom. And then... That only gives us production. This is a notoriously difficult city to take. I should have brought more guns. And... You now have a promotion. Swift Keel. We'll get you the promotion. And we'll keep firing with you so we can get your promotion as well. As well. Cool. We need these guys to stay on the road. Boom. And you can hook something up, hopefully. You can actually move in here and just help with that. Right, come at me. <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna pillage all the things. I know they are. This is not how the German Empire was supposed to fall. Alright, he's gonna give us some gold and some coffee. We'll take the coffee for happiness. I should be building these ones. <laughs> Rocket science has been mythologized all out of proportion to its true difficulty. And we'll take you out. And you out. Ooh. Ah, I hate how it does that. There we go. Good. Got that. And maybe take you out. Almost. Ooh, actually. Boom. Lamp. Alright. Now we should be able to take this city out. And a bit of damage to them. Yes! Washington is mine. We even got boosts to everything. Nice. So we finished that. We can now get our totalitarian government of fascism. Beautiful. Look at the changes that are about to be seen. Oh, ho. Ooh, yikes. Economic policies went down a bit. That's always a shame. <laughs> but I mean, fair enough, right? We're not really looking to trade of the world if you're a fascist power. So Raj, we don't, I don't know if we're even benefiting from that anymore. What we need more of is gold. Power plants, military academies, pretty good. Might be worth having. We've got tons of these military card points now. <laughs> so we'll look at these. Accumulate less war weariness. That's yep. That's handy. Uh, t -t 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 propaganda. Wait, what? Martial law versus propaganda. Less war weariness. Well, propaganda sounds more like what we would be as a fascist fascist Germany. So we'll take that. Uh, pillaging, pretty great. Encampment districts. Oh, I love the logistics. It's only handy, though, if we start in our own territory. But then again... Mm, then again... Maybe not as helpful now. I suppose we could stack these two, right? Like martial law and propaganda. 
if we wanted to. Atomic information era heavy and light cavalry units. Does that count as tanks? I guess it does. We might want some more tanks. Yield gain. We need more happiness. That's what we really, really need. So where's the happiness stuff? Happiness! Open borders with city-states. With all city-states and plus four influence points per turn towards earning envoys. Then why do we have that? Well, take number diplomacy. I didn't even see some of this stuff, and maybe I'm an idiot because of it. Yes, indeed. Peel, per gold appeal when replacing. No. Gold and cities not on your original capital's continent. That could be good. Who would have should have been? Archibellianism. I love the names of some of these as well. Now, the last one I need. Discount combat victories over units will give us gold, and that is something I certainly do like the sound of. So we'll see what happens with our little thing going on there. Oh, good. Economy restored itself a bit. Instead of crapping itself. And we will keep Washington, D.C. And use it, turn its own guns against itself. Bit of a bunker hill there. Ooh, we're at Wolf Toronto. Now, America, would you like peace? So, oh, wow. So these wonders aren't even in Washington. That's kind of a shame. So he gave us a crappy city to start with. Alright, so, Teddy. Teddy. Teddy doesn't want peace. Teddy's feeling pretty sad. Boost through a great scientist. Well, that's not going to happen. Helicopters. Nuclear submarines. Mechanized inventory sounds like something I want. And it's something that I think I should get. Market economy is also really, really good. Ooh, so we'll go for that. Sewers and shipyards. Washington, just rebuild your crumbling infrastructure. Like the US won't actually allow you to do. See, we're a more benevolent America. And we're not even America. Boom. Here we go down into here. And also you too. We'll get you to attack twice. We've got this lovely aircraft here to do some damage. I'm about to get a bomber at some point. Uh, we can start taking proper attacks against the city as well. And then we can just crush it. But I will take the promotion first. Fighting in a district. Could be good. Take it. Mm -hmm. Tank here. And, well, you've got a promotion now. Well done. You've also got a promotion, so we'll promote you. And then we'll get you to attack Ahmedabad. Yeah. So Cairo. We can also get submarines in and attacking Cairo. And yeah, Rio. Rio looks like an easier city to take than uh, Washington was. So yeah, that'll be our final target, I think. We'll try and take them both out at once. Oh, we'd have to go around to get this guy. Oh, no, we wouldn't. Oh! -ho! Well done, Jimmy. You are a victor. But my name was Jimmy. Not anymore, it isn't. Alright, let's get some promotions. Versus district defenses, yeah. Sounds like what we want to go for. This is naval units or plus one movement. I like plus one movement. Defenses. And we'll take the shot, actually. And I'll move you up here. Sleep. Man, I could take that city if I actually kept a unit around to do it. Huh. Could do it. Boom, 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 boom. Granary. Oh, look at that movement. That is so good. Right, you can actually get me that right there. And we can move on in. Jeez, where is the where's the army? Where's this massive monumental army that you know China supposedly had? It got very lackluster, didn't they? Alright, it's going to be a slog though getting in here. I might even detach the uh, general, get him to move up a bit, and even further. Cool. Not quite all the way. 
Right. Let us finally finish off this city. It's been driving us crazy for a very long time. It's our very own uh, Stalingrad. Boom! And now we shall raise you because we don't care about you. I know. <laughs> it's tragic. See, range attack available. Oh, it's a scout. What? They still have those? They come in pints. Maybe we should buy another unit. Or we could just build one. Oh, no, we can't. We can't just build one. Even this got crippled. Arg. Yeah, America will try to retake Washington. And they'll probably fail pretty catastrophically. We'll take our Metabad. Our made a beard. I made a bad. And you know what? It's funny because Greece might actually be my only kind of adversary in my way to getting to what I want. Which is quite amusing considering things. Because he's in my way now to get the victory. Alright, you take him out. You go here. And yeah, also upset some of that. And then you can also do a little bit of all of that. Yeah, America. You are... What? Is he a theocracy? He's a theocracy. Oh, you. <laughs> oh, gosh. Now, the question is... What are we doing here? Are we getting some research labs? Or repairing our workshops? Hmm. Seaports. And postal raiding. We'll probably do a bit of that with Cairo before we take it. Yeah, the good news is this army could easily just move across into Arabia. I don't think we're gonna try and take him out. It would be nice to get some ceremonial, you know, badassery revenge. Now, can these planes, in fact, yes, they can. Oh, only one. So, maybe if we redeploy to this tile. Probably not, though. Yeah, so we're probably only going to get one plane attacking on this place. Oh, this is the uh, the general. Oop, and oop. And... Plantation! Ha ha! Yeah, we've completely shattered the city down to zero, so I can bring in this unit. And maybe I could just, like, play with him a bit, you know? Have a bit of fun. Right, General's here. General quarters. For each rainforest. Where do we have rainforests? These aren't rainforests, are they? Are there rainforests in this land? There are down there. Rainforests, 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 rainforests. I don't really know if I want this guy. I mean, he's a bit lame. America's about to get the next dude, or dudette, but Mary Catherine Goddard and Jane Drew, which we are actually going to get. Which, hello, we could probably use right now. You know what, screw it, we're not spending any of our uh, faith on anything, so... Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Combat strength. We'll move you to here and then we'll get you promoted. Promotion, sir. Level of promotion on that man. He has served it with dignity and duty. And you can come along the path to here and then wait until you've got more movement. Da 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 da. Oh. Next turn. La Venta! We haven't taken any city-states this game, so we haven't used our ability very well. We did kind of the opposite. We just took over civilizations instead. Which I might say is acceptable. I rather like doing it. We're actually being kind of nice to our city-states. When I say our, I mean they are our city-states. Mine, mine alone. 
Alright, so we've taken down the health of that place. I told you to remain on the command ship. Imbecile. Oh, we can take another shot. Take another shot at the enemy. Oh, I'll just go there. Now, we can't take the city quite yet. Or can we? I mean, the whole bar's flashing. Oh, we did it! Boom! Moon! We did it. Oh, this is beautiful. Liberate to India? Hells no. Right. So we've got that in the bag. We've, we're have we going now to steamroll into Cairo. We must not enter Cairo. And now you've got your last promotion. Ho -ho. Okay, so you can move actually along to here and take the city immediately. So, boom. And boom. Take a meta bed as well. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh. I didn't realize it actually had some health left. Well, that's a booger. <laughs> I did not see that coming. Alright, America should be fine now. So my priorities are now going to be to descend on the fellows in the south. We're going to attack Brazil. And we're going to do Gairo. And we're going to peace out with China, actually. Alright, so seed, 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 war and peace, because, you know, Leo Tol Tolstoy, man. Uh, furs, pearls, spices. I wonder if they give me everything. Everything you own. I don't want to arm meta bed, actually. I want. Where is it? Oh, no, it's your capital. So we'll take our meta bed because we couldn't. I wouldn't do that. He would be willing to do that, though. But I don't want all these cities. All I need is our meta bad. Just be well, I don't need it, but it's symbolic victory, right? Yeah, return. Good return. But we won't. And I think that'll do. There we go. So that peace deal is actually great because then we get some more stuff. He's happy to construct. Wow, he actually is. Oh, cool! So that puts us in some really good positions to finish this game off. Now we do have an armor here. And we also have monuments to build and all that jazzeroony. Oop, that was not quite what I wanted, but alrighty. And we've got you. We've got you. We can take our lives, but they will never take our freedom. Alright, you can finally get that promotion you've been begging for. And maybe another, actually, because who knows? Zoo -doo -doo, you just go there and stick to your buddy. Make sure you, you keep him around. And then you can actually go over here. You stay there. Ooh, crazy redoubtable. The Tropic Victory. Because now we have a victory. Against the Tropics. And these submarines can come over as well. Now we're going to move our submarines over here, ready for the final conquest. And yes, we are going to activate Jane Drew, who will give us four housing in the city and free amenities. So at least our capital will be happy. And I think we can even use her again, so we'll use her on Sophia too. Yeah, to offset some of the violence that just happened in that city. Actually, how is this city doing for happiness? Good! Amenities are doing decently. Yeah, there's a bit of rebellion over here, but ah well! We're conquering the world. Cannot be concerned about enemy entanglements. Imperial entanglements. Next turn! I actually wonder though, how long has this turn gone on for? <laughs> da da da. Da 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 ba -dee day. How long will this episode go? Terracotta Army's here, and we possess it. Beautiful. Yeah, I know, you're here, but nobody cares. Wait, why would the Terracotta Army be in Delhi? <laughs> oh, Gandhi. <laughs> oh, Gandhi. You little cheeky devil, you. 
Alright, we'll move off our entire fleet. I know it sounds a bit unreasonable, but we do have that fort there to help us. Yeah, we can't get through here. And I am just going to check how long this episode's been. Well, guys, this episode has gone on for about uh, 25 minutes. I think that's a good time to end it anyways. I know it's not as long as usual, but it saves me going on until like 40 minutes. Thank you guys very much for watching anyways. I hope you enjoy the series as we're about to come to the climax. LOL. And uh, yeah, and I will see you for the next episode. Thank you guys.